Okay, uh, you were getting, after you asked, said, Lord, I promise you, if you send her the Holy Spirit back, I will not get in the way. And God heard that prayer. Yeah, he did. He did. And uh, uh, very briefly, in 92, you were both very hungry for God, mm -hmm. and you went to a Benny Hinn meeting. What we happened? We did. did. Uh, we did. And we'd been busy in the 80s learning other aspects of ministry about how to disciple people, how to get the heart healed up, and a big one was revelation of the Father's love. But it's hard to keep it all in proper balance of perspective. We went back to Benny's, and, and uh, we've known him a long time, but it, there was a reconnect just being with him. But we saw the lame walk, the blind see, the deaf hear, and about a thousand people come to Jesus. And we said, God, we have to have this. Well, he invited us back into the green room after the meeting, and as we came through the door, he just kind of lunged at us, you know, and just <laughs> boom, boom, we're down, both of us on the floor. And, and he's saying to me, pick up your wife, and I'm and like, there's no way. She was just completely, <laughs> completely <laughs> gone. gone. And so he says, okay, we'll leave her. Well, she just got so <laughs> electrified, just... <laughs> And I'm saying, baby, just stay under this. Don't yeah. try to get it together. I'll get you home. This is what we want. This is what we yeah. need. <laughs> okay. <sighs> this hunger got answered. And uh, January 20th, 1994, suddenly something so phenomenal happened, it affected the whole world. And what is coming right behind that suddenly is another suddenly. I want to pick up right there when we come back. The Spirit tells me Fidel Castro will die in the 90s. Oh my. Some will try to kill him and they will not succeed. But there will come a change in his physical health and he will not stay in power and Cuba will be visited of God. ABC News Special Report. And good evening, everyone. I'm Jonathan Betts at ABC News World Headquarters in New York. We are interrupting our programming to bring you some breaking news. ABC News has learned that longtime Cuban leader Fidel Castro has died. He was 90 years old. His death was announced by his brother Raul on Cuban state television just a few moments ago. Fidel Castro ruled Cuba for close... The Lord also tells me to tell you in the mid-90s, about 94, 95, no later than that, God will destroy the homosexual community of America. A lot of breaking news here this morning. The breaking uh, story just moments ago, the Supreme Court and this landmark ruling, the court uh, making same-sex legal, same-sex marriage legal in this country across every state in this nation. Going into today, 37 states in Washington, D.C., uh, 13 states illegal, but those 37 states had same-sex marriage, and now that will change uh, in all 50 states. I want to get back to John Carl. 